Welcome back to another episode. We are starting off this episode. Now we're playing Red Wolf. Going to Taurus Nabod. Can't believe I still haven't finished this game yet. No, no, wrong button. I want to pin all these. Perform three different glory kills on pain elementals. Um, I don't know what those are, but cool. Use the ice bomb to freeze ten demons. Acquire six codex entries. So I need to have this on... on, on ice. What are pain elementals? No, oh, what, what are... What are pain elementals? I... Ooh! Pain elementals, what do you look like? Oh, those things? I'm not doing that. No crucible is still embedded in the titan that attacked this sentinel city. Your first battle against the demons in this world, and where the legend of the Slayer began. Are you sure you're not tricking me? Ooh, this is pretty. Ooh, there's just no battery down there, even though I don't need it. Ha. Huh. Taras Nabod. The city of Taras Nabod was the crown jewel of Argent Dinner. For centuries, it served as the spiritual heart of Argent society, home to both the royal family and the center of political power. No expense was spared in the building of the city, with bold colonnaded architecture and tower monument, towering monuments to gods and kings resplendent on every avenue. Rural Argenta flocked to Taj Nabad on pilgrimage to the Maker Temples. The city was ground zero of a massive demonic invasion attempt, and although the invasion was thwarted, the attack changed Argenta society forever.
According to the Korax tablet, the city would have been lost had it not been for the arrival of the Slayer. You're dead now. God, was that annoying. I need to go back. There's a sentinel battery back there. There's a sentinel battery back here. platform or something. God. That's gonna be fun. There's a shit ton of them this time. What the hell? Am I supposed to go this way? Oh. No, I was supposed to go this way. drop so I can go back up. Do I need health? I didn't really need the health. Yeah, I did I have to drop to go back up. Oh no. Stop. Stop. Wait. Wait. 
Things will be different. No, there's... What is that? Is that a coin? Special. Oh, I'm supposed to hit him. Oh, there's a button. Button. What did that do? Can I do anything special? I'm supposed to just go in there now? Oh, oh, hell no. I'm not going in there. No! No, not until I figure out. I'm missing. There's got to be something I'm missing. Where is it? No. There's got to be something. There's got to be something I'm missing. Central battery down there. Is there another button? No. Maybe across the way is unlocked now? No, of course not. Come on, the button. Oh, it's. God, I feel so stupid. Let me use this mastery token on... This. Because I use that quite a bit. Okay, now I feel better with going in here. Okay. Can I not shoot? Hiya.
I missed that? Wait, can I go back? Run. I'll just get it at the end. I'm not gonna try and go back. Oh god. History of the Sentinels Part 10. With the coming of the Slayer, the Night Sentinels took the campaign deeper into the heartland of the demon of the demons that than ever before mighty atlans were brought forth tearing paths through the hordes of hell alongside the slayer and his army the high priest under the guidance of the mother god had found means to gain entry to the innermost regions of the demon world and with the deeds presence new gates can be opened Sorry, I had to drink. I thought my mouth was getting dry. Our war machines were unstoppable, wrought with maker technology. Enhanced by the very essence, our enemies hurled against us as our armies drove deeper and deeper into the blood-drenched territory of the demons. Countless victories were assured with the power of the Slayer, for with the Alpha and Interfector at the four of our pack, we brought certain doom to our foes, and though our hearts were pure and our purpose righteous, unbe un unbeknownst to the fighters of Argenta, in our wake and under the veil of secrecy, the mother god had sent her, priests to build vast factories upon the heathen's land, that she might gather the essence for further de development. How this deception deception began, we would not know. For our focus remained on the hordes of the underworld. Why then would we stoop so low as to consider our mother god of betraying our covenant? The conmaker did not seem to ease at ease with the unforeseen rise of our slayer, and the seraphim who had birthed a destroyer in secret soon vanished from Yurdok, perhaps exiled for his air sea our legions rose on fettered under the unquenchable rage of the doom slayer and his design led the con maker to find profit in his endorsement it soon became known that the slayer was the maker's god machine a holy relic reborn sent to bring the maker's world word to the wicked and to smite those who would seek to harm all who followed the path to your dock with the slayer unwittingly cleaving a path for her the mother god siphoned the essence processing it beyond our knowledge into the fuel that would come to be known as argent energy oh god that's a big paragraph the slayer cared not for polity he took no interest in the workings of our people but sent but set his task only on his desire, the destruction of the demons and their world. He no longer spoke for reasons unknown, though it was understood that he still possessed the ability, offering only guttural hefts of anger as he inflicted pain upon his enemies. For years, he marched with the night sentinels through the fires of the demon lands, and every return to our home world found much change in Argentiner. Should any blame be a portion to the sentinels it is this on our fervor we were negligent to our people and did not see the rising tide of evil our crusade empowered we knew only the enemy laid before us the wealth of argenta at our backs and did not pause to seek the 
cost and method of this progress. Oh, and with that, guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.